Hi guys, this is Chelsea with Reborn Zarras. Um, I was planning on doing a video today. I have some custom pacifiers to open with everybody. Um, this is the first time that I ordered from uh, this custom pacifier site, so it's super cool. Um, and I want to thank uh, Peyton from Vinyl Angels Nursery for um, not only introducing me to the site, but the awesome coupon code. And in today's video, I have Parker Kyra, who is my Asher by Donna Lee Sculpt, and she was reborn by Nikki Holland of Still Moments Nursery. So, without further ado, I think we're gonna get into opening the pacifiers and she's super cute she looks so newborny she's supposed to have that like hours old look so she's got pretty heavy um pretty heavy mottling which i love so i i love mottling on my babies so i haven't done anything i haven't looked at these um I just have the package turned around so you guys can't see my address, and all I did was rip it open. And I will put the um, link to this website in um, the description of this video. Um, so we got, looks like coupons. Um coupons to looks like a bunch of different things so that's cool oh cool and uh, the different amounts of uh, and looks like also a discount on baby formula which we all know that we don't really need. <laughs> I have to save these. This is cool. So, for those of you that haven't been on this site, um, basically, and it's custompacifiers.com, basically you get to design, um, there's ones to choose from, and then you can actually drag and put your own photos and stuff onto the pacifiers and pick the colors that you want the base to be. So it's super, super cool. And Peyton um, from Vinyl Angels Nursery on Instagram did an awesome deal um, where you got basically three um, pacifiers for free, which were worth about $30. Um, um, when you put in her coupon code. So it was super cool and super nice of her to do that. Um, so I ended up getting four because I paid for one extra. Now the site, if you buy three pacifiers, you get one for $5. So um, I did the extra one. And um, I think I ended up having to pay for shipping. But e even that, it was rather affordable. So um, I, again, I just want to thank... Peyton, because this was a really cool thing, and I'm definitely going to have to go back to the site. So, the first pacifier I got. Now, this has my um, zebra theme. It actually matches the bed sheet that's under this um, purple blanket. Let me see if I can move a piece of it for you guys. It might not show up too well, but it's basically... This theme with the, um, with the mint Reborn Zaras, so that's super cool. And I picked the, um, green base because, uh, just something that could be gender neutral, but, um, all right, it's not gonna let me do both, <laughs> but I just, I have to modify all of these still, so I can't actually, like, put them on Parker's face for you guys, but, I mean, as you guys can see, these will be super cute. I can't wait to modify them. Um, and this is another picture I had. This is a picture that uh, I kind of made. I took the uh, zebra off 
the internet and put it on the pink background that is associated with my Instagram account. And it does say, I don't know if you can read it because they're tiny, but it does say Reborns R Us along the bottom and then with a green base. So, super cool. So pretty. Here, let's see if I can kind of... Yeah. See, that's going to look so cute on her. And all the other babies. <laughs> so I got the two green bases. Um, and then this one is my Instagram logo and watermark. Um, and this one was the one that Shaylin Maxwell of Reborn Sweet made for me, which, thank you again, Shay. I love it. And I try to put it on almost all of my photos. Once in a while, I forget. But, <laughs> um, I really, really love this design. And I think that's gonna be super cool to, um, put on the baby's face. And I'm trying to get one of my New Year's resolutions is to, um get good at good better not maybe not good good but better at the painting so it would be really cool to take like work in progress photos with um pacifiers with my logo and stuff and then this one um Shay made for me as well she gave me a couple different ones um in a couple different colors so this again says Chelsea Hailson Dolls Reborns R Us, which is my Instagram. And then it has the green, which I love. So, and then once again, um, super, super cute on Parker. And I, I just love that uh, it um, has my logo. So that'll be fun to, it'll be almost like a new uh, way of um, watermarking too because um, the watermark and the logo's on the pacifier. So, that'll be cool. Um, and I also have a few more here, because I went back a few days later. Um, they had a um, Valentine's Day sale, which is was basically similar to what Peyton was doing. Um, you put in there, like, I think it was V-Day, 20 or something like that and you basically got $30 off so I did the same thing that I did with um, Peyton's coupon code I um, bought one extra because um, it was you know you buy three you get one for five dollars so I didn't want to pass up on that deal and then like I said I think I paid for shipping but it was affordable and I did it all last week it was here uh, yesterday, which was Monday, so, um, and I just paid for, like, regular economy shipping, so, they were, they were fairly quick, so, some more coupons, I'm sure it's the same as the last ones, and I haven't looked at these either, These ones are a different theme. I just thought it would be cool to have some um, different ones. So this one is Little Mermaid. Uh, it says Under the Sea. I actually did um, make this one. Like I cropped the photo of uh, all the different Ariel characters and put it on the bubbles and put the words on there. So this one I did make. Um, thought it would be cool to have different ones, different outfits and stuff. And then I like the uh, glitter purple because it's uh, the Little Mermaid. So, oh my gosh, she's cute. <laughs> Here, put her arm down. <laughs> okay. This one I did not make. Um, this one I found in like the um, the make to sale ones. Um, I don't know if you guys remember The Little Mermaid too, but um, I grew up watching it several times, so I couldn't resist it when I saw it. I, I actually was surprised that there was one from The Little Mermaid too, because that one's not as popular as 
the Little Mermaid, obviously, <laughs> but, um, it was one of my childhood things, and, um, I guess that's one of the lines on the song or something, but, um, I thought it was very pretty nonetheless, so, and it has, like, the Little Mermaid colors, the purple and green, so, And again, these I have to modify. <laughs> um, this one I did make. Um, Mulan was another movie that I grew up on. And I, I, that was like one of those... Um, I came across it on the internet a while ago. I've had it in my phone saved. Um, it was only one of those fan fictions where somebody draws and adds into the picture. And I liked how she was holding a baby. Um, I put it on the cherry blossoms and everything and added the words, but I thought that one was a really pretty one um, once I actually had it made, because I was just goofing around. I hadn't actually planned on buying more, um, but I was just using the site and goofing around and making some pictures because I was bored, and it turns out I like really liked them, so I ended up buying them, and they came out really nice. I wasn't sure in person how they would look, but so that one's Mulan. And I have these pictures, so if I, um, the, you know, want to make, you know, get the same pacifier again, like, I've kept the pictures, um, it'll be no problem. And then this one I made as well, um, just has a few lines from the, from the movie, and then it's Mulan with the cherry blossoms. And then in my nursery colors, I did the mint and the, and the pink. But... I thought it would be nice to have some different um, characters and themes for different outfits and different role plays and stuff. Um, as you can see, Parker looks the sweetest. I love her. Um, so, yeah, that was my last pacifier. <laughs> um, I can't wait to modify these. These are going to be super duper cool once I actually get them to where they can stick on somebody's face. <laughs> Um, but I don't want to talk on for too long, so I'll let you guys go. Um, it's been nothing but rain here in New England, so lighting sucks. Um, we haven't really done much besides work, so don't have much to talk about in that regards. Um... I did get a first glimpse of, um, not like a first glimpse, but a more recent glimpse of, uh, Knox, who's being painted by, um, Shaylin Maxwell of Reborn Sweet. I love how he's coming out. He's looking so newborny and cute. Um, I can't wait to see him with some hair because he's already just so gorgeous. So I'm super duper excited to, to see how he comes out because he's a artistic freedom baby. So, and I love 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 his turnout so far so i i can't wait to see um the final product with him um and besides that um i haven't seen any of my uh newer still moments nursery babies they're still being worked on um yeah i'd say that's it so i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your tuesday you guys stay dry if you're in my neck of the woods, and hopefully snow is not too bad for everybody else, or the heat. I know it's hot for some of you. Um, so have a good Tuesday, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. God bless. Bye.